Hi, welcome to Automate, I'm Clint. In this video, I'll demonstrate the correct and most efficient way to check and adjust shim type valve clearances. A small clearance is needed between the valve stem and camshaft to allow for thermal expansion and acceptable wear of the valve face and seat. Manufacturers have different time and or distance intervals for checking and adjusting this clearance. Too much clearance and the engine will suffer performance losses due to a decreased valve lift. An indication of this may be a noisy valve train. Too little clearance results in unwanted valve lift, possible riding valves, decreased performance due to compression losses and increased emissions. The specifications for this vehicle with the engine cold and not running are intake 0.21 of a millimetre or 8 thou and exhaust 0.31 of a millimetre or 12 thou. Rotate the engine in a forward direction only. This is good practice to ensure the cam chain or belt does not jump position. Set number one cylinder on top dead centre compression stroke. This is evident by the cam base circle being adjacent to the cam follower. On an inline engine, the corresponding cylinder's valves will be rocking. If you would like to continue learning about this topic and get complete access to our extensive video library, you need an Automate membership. Visit our website and get started on a better future with better training.